Hello and welcome to another video from me, Rough Swordsman Wargamer. It's another open the box video and this time it's another Panzer Grenadier expansion. This time Airborne, released in 2001. So, what have we got here? US Airborne Operations, Normandy, 1944. 6th of June 1944, it says 1994 there, I think, that's a bit of a mistake. Floating down from the pre-dawn skies over Normandy, American soldiers created a new word for courage, airborne. In a few short weeks, they defeated Germany's battle-hardened troops, making a mockery of the much-vaunted Atlantic Wall. So airborne, 20 new scenarios, add these heroes to the Panzer Grenadier game system. Play this game alone or add it to previous games in the series. Panzer Grenadier, the Eastern Front and heroes of the Soviet Union and watch for new upcoming titles. Crikey. So as always, 30 minutes or more, 200 meters a hex, units are platoons, 165 playing pieces. So it's quite a small little game. And it only has one geomorphic hard mounted game board. And the old 16 page rules and 20 scenarios. So, let's see what's inside. Let's open the box. It was already punched and uh, I couldn't resist, I couldn't wait. I've clipped them already. So here's the American Airborne. We have the Germans, of course. I do like the counters in Pan uh, Panzer Grenadier. And these markers. Now, these are a little different to um, normal. And uh, I quite like them. Here's a moved fire from that set. And here's one from a sort of more recent set. I like it as well because um, I can have two different uh, counters for the two different sides so I know which is which rather than just having a, a field of uh, the same moved and fire counters. The other thing which is intriguing is on the other side of some of these it has opportunity fire and these aren't printed anymore I don't think. Uh, in the rules it says put two fired moved tokens on something that is going to uh, do opportunity fire because you get two cracks at it but this I think it looks like you can put one of those on and a fire a moved fire token and take that off and you're just left with the uh, the other one so that that's good right well we got a couple of old dice again pick this up very reasonably I'm actually board game geek the geek market there this is the second edition rules so again 16 pages we won't be using those because, as I say, I've got the, the fourth edition rules, but there we are, they're there. And here's the tables. And weirdly, for some reason, I've got two copies of each of the old ones. So that's direct fire. You've seen these before. Bombardment. And terrain effects. Again, be using uh, the version 4 one two of those for some reason, and uh, Assault, there we are, look at that, look at that turn record. <laughs> and uh, I'm not sure what these are, these were in the, uh, in the box, unless of course uh, the person that had this before has just made this up to print out to do some sort of campaign or to keep record of what's going on. Uh, not sure. And here's the scenarios. 20 of them. And most of them are single, uh, single map. But the good thing is, because it says um, Eastern Front, some of these, you see, these, I believe, are the Eastern Front maps. So I've got uh, extra scenarios for those as well. So that's good. Most of them though do have just the one map. Here's another one. 
with uh, Eastern Front maps. So, excellent. And the special rules for those scenarios on the front. And last but not least, we have the mounted map board. And there we are. So most of the scenarios are played out on this. Might be a bit awkward if uh, a scenario uses this one and some of these sort of um, cardboard maps from Eastern Front, but uh, we'll see, we'll see. So there we are. That is Panzer Grenadier Airborne 2001 from Avalanche Press, US Airborne Operations in Normandy. Hope you've enjoyed that. If you have, please subscribe, like the video, comment, all that sort of thing. And until the next time, you take care and goodbye.